To anyone who took the time to click on this video, hello, my name is Tripster, and before I get started and jumping into this, uh, I want to give a shout out to a friend of mine, Chris. He's a real life friend of mine, and he's just been really supportive of the whole YouTube thing, and you know, he's he's a good friend. He's an old friend of mine, so I feel like you know he supports me, so why not support him? Give him a little bit of a shout out, you know. Um, he specifically said that he wanted to see some more Mafia too, so his wish is coming true. Uh, now, for those of you that have just clicked onto the video, if you haven't seen my first two episodes, I do recommend you go and watch those first. However, if you've already seen Mafia playthrough before, which you probably have, then feel free to just jump on in with us right here if you just want to see a different side of the story. Uh, let's see, where do we leave off? I believe we are at Senor Joe Barbaro's house. Joe Barbaro. Yeah, chapter three enemy of the state Joe's apartment February 10th 1945 what's up Vito how you doing man yeah we're at uh, Joe's apartment I remember we were gonna go answer the phone last time where we left off let's go do that now this is the bathroom there's another door and that leads to the phone now before we answer that phone if you look here got all of our stuff over here you know we got our toothbrush we got some what? some Gertz old timer I don't know what that is I'm gonna okay can I turn this on can I go okay can I turn you on oh boy I can turn you off I'm turn you back on though I turn you on run Joe's bill up there we go let's answer this phone hello Joe's pleasure pal it's Vito speaking Vito why didn't you come home last night I was worried sick mama I didn't know you had Joe's number. And whose phone is this? So have you spoken to Mr. Papalardo to find yourself a job? Yeah, he told me to come by and see him today. Hopefully he's got some work for me. Okay, Vito. Good luck, mio bambino. All right, bye, Mama. Love you, Mom. Now, look at these... Look at this reflection. I think this game out... This game came out in, uh, 2010, was it? Yeah, that's... Do I have to get dressed? Oh, I do. Wow. I don't, even, I don't have any more clothes just yet. So, uh, hello. Oh, there? Uh, hi there. What's the matter? Nothing good on the radio? Mind your beeswax, kid. Uh, oh, hey. We, we will fight. We will go out in that parking lot and we will have an all-out brawl with the two of us. I'm just kidding, you good people. Um, but yeah, you guys that have been supportive so far of everything, I mean... Down, I'm I'm the cops. Polish flags Hello? Fly high in celebration as the Polish people have okay, I'm just gonna... You don't turn that crap down! I'm just gonna get out. Okay. But yeah, the, those of you that have been, like, so supportive of this, like, thank you so much. I mean, it honestly means a lot. Uh, 320... Okay, yeah, we're Like, I've mentioned in... One of my other videos, I can't remember which one. That, uh, this, this is something that I've been interested in doing for a while. Uh, the fact that I'm actually able to do it now is it's amazing in my mind. I've, I've already said that once before. This, this is true. And the fact that anyone cares enough to, you know, check out what I have to share and offer to everyone is. I mean, it's amazing. You know, I know I don't have big numbers like a lot of the big YouTubers that I'm sure you watch. Like me, I watch a lot of huge YouTubers. Like my favorite YouTuber is Jack Sutton. You know, he's over 12 million. And he's so sincere with everything. You know, I like him. And this, it's... You know, I, like at the time I'm making this, I'm only just over 100 views, I think. And, uh, I have, like, 39 subs right now. Yeah, 39. And, yeah, that's a small number, but to me, that's, that's phenomenal. I mean, you know, I'm not doing this to try and become big or anything. You know, I'm just doing it because it's something that interests me. It's something that I I would like to do. Um, so I hope you guys don't mind me having a little monologue when we're driving to a location. <laughs> but... It's just something that I enjoy doing, and uh, I've wanted to do for a while, like I said. And the fact that there's, 
you know, even one person is interested in you know, keeping up and checking out my content is amazing. We had a long, not to mention there's, you know, I can't even count on all my hands and toes together, you know, how many there are already, which is, I love that. It's fantastic. Thank you so much. Honestly. Um, I say that as I'm just smacking at everything driving around. <laughs> I need to focus on the world. Focus on the world, focus! So, um, yeah, I'm tired of driving on the road. We're gonna go off road here for a sec. Oh boy. Alright, good off road times. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I remember this one house. Sweetness. Uh, chief office. All right. By the way, if I haven't mentioned it before, or I have mentioned it, but if you haven't checked it out, oh, cutscene. Oh, I'll resume what I said just a minute. This guy, I like this guy, Derek. Oh, close the door. It's windy. What do you want? Oh uh, yeah, I'm looking for a Mr. Papolato. Oh yeah. Why? My name's Vito Scaletta. My old man used to work for him, and I'm looking for a job, so I came here. Well, you're in the right spot, sonny boy. Federico Papayato at your service. You can call me Derek. I think I remember your dad. Good guy, but drank like a fish. What's he up to these days? He's dead. Oh, well. So subtle. Y'all gotta go sometime. Right, Steve? Sure, Derek. Sure, Derek. So you need a job, man? Huh? Well, you're in luck. We just got a new shipment to unload. Steve will show you around. Now, Scram, my steak's getting cold. You don't like cold steak? Uh, follow me. You know, if you've ever seen uh, Breaking Bad, which Breaking Bad, by the way, is my favorite TV show. If you've never seen it, get off YouTube. Go watch Breaking Bad right now. Um, Steve reminds me a lot of Mike uh, from Breaking Bad. Mike Ehrman Trout. All right, what are we doing, Steve? Load Hello? this pile of crates onto that truck. When you're done, you get ten okay. bucks. If something gets lost or broken, you get nothing. Start now and don't take all day. Ten bucks for moving some crates. Okay, so we'll take these crates and put them on that truck these crates that truck got it and over here mm. Ugh, so heavy up the stairs come on Vito Vito Scaletta come on boyo huh. Huh. what's in this box are these pizza toppings taco toppings what are they you know, well, the door's open leaving, you had enough. Well, you know, I, I moved one crate. That's that's enough. We're just gonna, we're gonna get on out now. I'm tired. Going home hey, for the day. You done? Yeah, I'm done. And you can keep the ten bucks. When I said I needed a job, I didn't mean slave labor. Whatever. Get the fuck out of here, then. Don't show your face around here again. Yeah, don't worry. I can make a hundred times more working for Barbaro Incorporated. Wait. You said Barbaro? Joe Barbaro? Yeah, so what? Shit, nobody who works with Joe would carry crates for ten bucks. What the hell are you doing? Come with me. Alright, Mike, let's go. And yes, I called him Mike on purpose. Did you see what I did there? I'm funny, right? Guys laugh at my jokes, please. Aw, oh, Mike, what are you doing? Steve, crap. I'm confusing myself now. I'm just gonna stick with Steve. I don't want to confuse myself or anybody else. Uh, Empire Bay. Alright. What now? Well, this one don't like <laughs> manual labor. What the fuck? Said he works with Joe Barbaro. Bullshit. Mm -hmm. Wanna load crates if he works with Joe. You'll me. have to explain this one to me, sonny boy. What's your story? Uh, well, my mother wanted me to come talk to you about an honest job, but I need some real money, so this ain't gonna cut it. <laughs> Them women, they're all the same. 
Right, Steve? Sure, Derek. Sure, She doesn't want Derek. you hanging around with Joe, right? <laughs> My mother was the same way. Look what become of me. Union boss, I got the whole fucking waterfront under my thumb. So how's Joe? Pretty good, I guess. How'd you meet up with him? Oh, we go way back to the old neighborhood. I just come back from overseas and he's putting me up until I can get back on my feet. Listen, you gotta understand, a person in my position has gotta be careful. Certainly. So you won't mind if I give Joe a call, right? Nah, go ahead. Now, where'd I put his number? Hey, here it is. Derek. I'm smart enough to know that's not a number. Well, it kind of looks like a 7, depending on which way you put it. You got me. Derek's too smart for me. He might not be home. Oh, he's home. He's at his pleasure palace. I promise you he is. That wouldn't be good. Joe? Joe? You can answer the phone, Joe. Joe! Hi, Joe. Hey, this is Derek. Hey. Listen, I got this guy here. Uh, what'd you say your name was? Vito. 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 He's looking for a job. He says he's a friend of yours. A good friend. I just wanted to check with you first. Uh-huh. Sure. War hero and all that shit. All right, all right. Thanks, then. I'll talk to you later. Sorry, pal, I had to check you out. Joe says you just come back from Italy. You must mm -hmm. be able to handle yourself. Of course. You want to make a little more money? I got just the thing. The guys here at the port are supposed to pay a monthly fee to the barber, but half of them never cough it up. I need someone to give them a little nudge. Ten bucks a man. What if they don't need a haircut? Well, then you'll have to convince them otherwise. I see. What if somebody makes a fuss? Then you kick the shit out of them. Well, let's say you teach them a lesson that doesn't require that they miss work, you got it? Which is why Steve ain't doing the job. Right, Steve? Right, boss. <laughs> Collect at least 150 bucks, I give you 50. Just for walking around, taking it into Sierra, meeting new people. Easy fucking money, eh? What do you say? Sure thing. Hey, it's better than lugging crates around. All right, then. Get going. All right, now before I get out there and take care of the business. I just want to point out, Derek's been eating that same steak for like 10 minutes. Um, and if he's not done with that by the time I come back, then I'm going to kick him in his tits. So. Oh yeah, but what I was saying about my Twitter earlier, sorry. Uh, if you guys are interested in following me on there, keeping up with, you know, what's going on with the channel, uh, I also shout out some other YouTubers and other people on there, other awesome people. It's just at its Tripster. It's always going to be in the description if you want to check I'm it out. I'm here to collect the fee for the bob. Uh, yeah. I must have forgot or something. Thanks. Appreciate your cooperation. Thank you. Now I don't have to kick you in the teeth. Hey, Bob. How about you? Derek needs you to pay the fee for the bob. Sure, here it is. I don't want no problems. Next time, try to pay on time, okay? Thanks. Yeah. Don't start none, won't be none. Alright. Hey, are you are you hitting the floor over here? Are you mad at the floor? Are you mad because it, you don't have the money to pay or something? Hey, Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. You've got the wrong guy, pal. My wife cuts my hair. Yeah, that's sweet. But while you work here, you get a haircut when Derek says. Hey, you gonna pay? Oh. Hey! Okay, okay, enough already. Here's your fucking money. Yeah, glad you decided to reconsider. It flashed the prompt to, uh, fight. So we have to beat him up. Hey, pal. Derek needs you to pay the fee for the barber. Look, asshole. I'm not in the mood. Why don't you get out of my face before you get hurt? <sighs> what? No can do, pal. Derek wants his money. Derek can kiss my ass. What's that fat fuck gonna do? Have me killed? Hey, you yeah. said it, not me. Why don't you give it a try then, asshole? Oh, come on, boy. I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> give me the money! Mm. Mm. Just some. Give me... the money! 
big boy. I, I couldn't think of another joke. I was trying to think of a joke for every single punch I hit, but okay. Alright, you come this way. Come back into the light. Let everyone see. Let everyone see what's occurring. And... George! Oh, oh, oh. What? Okay. Anybody else? Got a fucking problem with paying for the fucking barber? You better not. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Do you? This guy already paid. Do you? But, are you sure he did? Did he really? Did you pay, sir? I got his money already. Okay, I got your money. I'm gonna assume everyone else paid. And if they didn't pay, I'm watching you guys. I'm watching you. Just know that. Here's the money, boss man. Good job. Here's your share. I watched you take care of Bill. You were good. Steve damn near got his ass kicked when he tried that. Right, Steve? Yeah. <laughs> right, Derek. Here's a bonus for sorting him out. Thanks. The guy's been a real fucking pain. Now get out of here, kid. I gotta be getting back to business. And say hello to your mother for me. Tell her you got yourself a job as my new assistant. Yeah, we'll yes. do. I'll see Sweet. you later. And Vito, uh, right. I almost forgot. Joe called. He wants you should meet him at Freddy's. Freddy's, gotcha. Alright, now, you need to finish your steak, because I said I was going to kick you in the tits, but I can't physically do that because the game won't let me. You're lucky, Derek. You're lucky. But uh, while Derek's over there chowing down on the steak for the millionth time, I'm going to go ahead and cut this video here. Um... Guys, if you stuck around towards the end, thank you so much for watching towards the end. Or if you're just skipping through because you're bored and you happen to stick on or stop on this particular part. Hi, how you doing? I'm Bob. Um, thank you guys so much for sticking around. I do hope you guys enjoy the content. If you did, please hit that like button. Uh, please drop a comment letting me know what you'd like to see, uh, what you thought about the video, any suggestions or comments you may have. And of course, uh, hit that subscribe button if you would like to continue to see content and support me. It would be a huge help. I appreciate every single individual that takes the time to, you know, click that, uh, click the subscribe button and watch the videos and comment. And I, this is like a really small like thing I have going, like I mentioned earlier, and it's great. I love it. You know, thank you guys so much for sticking around. Thank you guys for being here, and. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.